Ladies and gentlemen, it's the day of the finals. The best tennis players of the ATP 250 Malaysian Open 2012 in Kuala Lumpur fight for points, prize money and glory. But apart from great tennis, we have seen that a tennis tournament isn't only about tennis. For example, now you know how these delicious chocolate chip cookies are made. And how easy it is to end up in a souvenir shop. Just by coming to the stadium, visitors ended up with free t-shirts and had the chance to win an exclusive watch. Not without potential harm to body and friends in the process though. Most important were all those great people we've met. School kids and students came to the tennis stadium in the hundreds. Some even drove all night in a bus to witness awesome tennis at the Malaysian Open. We witnessed close encounters between grown-up tennis stars and many enthusiasts on the court and the autograph signing booth. Part of the highlights this year were for sure the players' party, where definitely the girls rocked the place. and the unique tennis match on the 63rd floor, high above the streets of Kuala Lumpur. The finals were spectacular this year. In a gut-wrenching match, Bruno Suarez and Alexander Peya took home the trophy as the winning doubles team. Here in the stadium reached ecstasy levels when Juan Monaco beat Julian Beneteau in a tight three-hour singles final match. <laughs> to top the weekend off, another exclusive Rado watch was given away. Big thanks to all who came to the tennis stadium in Kuala Lumpur or followed our daily broadcast on the internet. Hope to see you and more of your friends and family next year, same time. Goodbye. <laughs>